Thanks for being here. I love the book. I love the way you talk about, first of all, the way you run uh, the company, the way when you uh, got on board and started running the company, and to this day, the way you run it, and the way that you balance your life and enjoy life, I think is a really great lesson for everybody Thank when they you. read this book. Thank you. It's fantastic. So, and here's what I, and I was, I was reading this in the New York Times article about you uh, on Sunday, that, uh, that you wake up every morning at 4.15 to work out. I do. I Every, do. like seven days a week. Sounds kind of sick, doesn't it? It does. Yeah, I do for a variety of reasons. You know, first of all, in a job like this at a company like Disney, we're so large, there's so much for me to do that if I don't get up early, I can't possibly do it all. But I also need that quiet time, that time to think and create and just generally be alone with my thoughts. It also gives me the ability to come home at a reasonable time and be with my family. So. Right, but so seven days a week, 4.15? I get up at 4.30 on weekends. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I, you sleep, I sleep in. in. Yeah, I give yeah. myself a little present. <laughs> yeah, but you look great, and you're in good shape, and that, that uh, it, it shows. You. Almost so, 69 years old, so. Yeah, I know. He looks amazing. Thank you. Um, so you were the president of ABC when my sitcom was on. What do you remember about that time? Long time ago, by yes, the way. Yes, it was, 21 years, 22 years ago. Um, well, obviously, what I remember the most is talking to you about coming out on the show. Mm -hmm. which I think it was 1997. The show had been on for a few years. Five years, at yeah. At that point. And I remember, I don't remember it all. I remember the show, the episode, very, it was actually a two-parter, if right. I recall correctly. Right, exactly. And the airport scene right. was the big one. I remember talking to you about it. Mm -hmm. And I mean, it was obviously a very different time. Right. And it was a huge decision for you. Yes. But it was something that was really important to you. Right. And I remember working with you to try to figure it out and wanting to basically give, the, give you the ability to do that. Yes, and thank you for allowing me to do that on television. I think right. that it was, uh, I appreciate it. It was, uh, I mean, it was historic. Yeah. And, and uh, I think to this day, it, it's, it still feels that way. Yeah, well, uh, hopefully we've come a, a, a long way, but we still have a long way to go. I and I know you do a lot to, to help that in the company. Um, a lot of people feel, uh, including Oprah Winfrey, who I think a lot of people respect and admire, and I think you did think for a second about uh, running for president. Um, or did you think for a second about She thinks you should have run for president. She was, yes, she, she has said that to me a number of times has been vocal about it lately. Right. I'm running the Walt Disney Company. Yes, you are. I'm not running for president. Right. I'm not running anything else. Uh, yes, it was something I considered at one point, but, um, but briefly. Yeah. So it's a big, what it's about... It's a big decision to make. It's huge, and I can't imagine anybody wanting to have that job. No matter how much you <laughs> go in with good intentions, there are so many people that tr try to block you from the things that you want to do, either side. Um, you're, but you're stepping down... Uh, in two years? A couple of years, yes. And so maybe then? Uh, it's not, right now, not in my plans. Right, I know, but things change. So I'm thinking oh, the two of us together oh, could run. That's where you're going. Yeah. We can, yeah. We can uh, practice uh, raising uh, our hands. Yeah, oh, oh, see, that was <laughs> How awkward. How do we do that? No, that was awkward, and then people work. are going to, that would it be a work. meme, and then like we're going to. Wait, gonna... I should ask, vice president or president? Or... No, I would just be the vice president. I see. Yeah, I would, I would allow you to be president. <laughs> yeah. Right. Well, we have time to think about that. All right, we have two years. We do. Yeah. Um, why, I, 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 I've heard you say why, but I'll let you in your own words say, I, first of all, it is, like I said, it's a, it's a great book, and it's, it's really about leadership, and uh, I love the way it starts. I love, you know, you talk about important things, but why did you write the book? Well, I've been in this job for about 15 years. I've been at, at ABC and Disney for 45 years. And uh, I call it the ride of a lifetime because it's been quite a ride. And there's a double entendre with rides in yes. Disney, of I course. got it. Uh, and over the years, a lot of young people have asked me for advice. You know, what's the secret to my success? How did I get where I am? And I like to give back, and I, I like to give people advice, but it also takes a lot of time, and it can't do it efficiently, at least to a lot of people. And so I thought, you know, writing it down would be a nice way to impart the advice that everybody's always asking for. Yep. And I did it in a way that enabled me to tell stories, because at Disney, you tell stories. Right. And rather than writing what I consider to be a dry business book, 
I wanted to entertain. It is entertaining. I hope I, do that. I hope I do that. Yeah, and it's uh, but you worked really hard. And at the last minute, I read that you you uh, kind of edited down twenty eight hundred pages. Yeah. Um, no, so twenty eight. I made <laughs> I made two thousand eight hundred edits. Edits. Okay. So it was what was it? supposed to be the final manuscript. Uh huh. That's, I don't advise anybody who's writing a book to approach it that way. Yeah, that's, that's a <laughs> Take lot. Take your time, do it over a couple of years. Well, it's, um, uh, I, I just, I think that you're a brilliant man, and, oh, uh, nice and I think that you uh, really have some, you've done amazing things for, for the Disney company. Thank you. And um, I think that we're all lucky to, to have you, and this is a, a Thank great you. book. Everyone in the audience is going home with a copy of Bob's book. <laughs> we'll be back.